I want you to be good wives out there. I want you, when you get married, your husband, to buy me a car. Yeah. And say, Prophet, thank you so much for grooming this, uh, this lady for me. Yeah. Hallelujah. They must honor me in Jesus' mighty name. All right. Let me just maybe give you a few, few things, though it's not everything. Um, um, can you write, what is a wife? What is a wife? What is a wife? A true wife. All right, not just a wife, but what is a true wife? What is a true wife? Because it's important to know. On your own, you will see whether you are ready or not. <laughs> Hallelujah. And when you feel you are still a girl, stop praying about marriage. <laughs> Start praying about the work of God. And when time comes, when God is matured, you, you, will, you will go there. Now, number one. A wife, and you write, a wife has integrity. Because there are some women that are married and they are suffering in their marriages. Why? Because the husband is not seeing a wife. So it's a big problem in a lot of ladies because they wonder why the husband sometimes maybe ends up going outside looking for uh, extramarital affairs, girlfriends out there, and leaving them. What is the problem? It's some of these things here yeah, are not being seen. They can stay uh, by mistake. You can just uh, stay in that marriage. They can stay. Some are staying with girls inside. But you find out those marriages have no joy. They are not enjoying those marriages. Uh, it's just uh, fighting, quarreling, arguments, and all sorts of things that are negative, which are happening. And at the end, the marriage cracks. There's big cracks, and it results in divorce. And that's why there are too many divorce courts uh, uh, in the, all over the world. Do you know I was shocked that some divorce cases are booked in the next three years to be heard by a judge. Because there is no space. You have to wait. All over the world, some are booked after two years. That's when they have to hear that case. And some are even bribing f so that the divorce uh, is, is, is done faster. They bribe magistrates or other things so that the divorce, so that they get married quickly to somebody. So it's because of lack of knowledge. People are just entering marriage. I say it's it's a dark room. When you enter it without knowledge, you come out as fast as you entered. You'll be just the hand, an invisible hand, who just slap you out of that marriage. So I said, number one, I want to teach you what is a wife. A wife has integrity integrity because you will be a mother you will be a, mom, a, a wife is a person who is ready to be a mother of children so a, a, a wife has integrity a wife is has integrity integrity is a woman with weight a woman with value uh, a, a, a woman who knows what is supposed to be done, like I was saying, integrity is when you are able to say no to sex, when you are, when you are able to keep your body and you are not willing to expose your nakedness. Uh, all that is it's, it's carelessness. You, you, you are not showing signs of integrity. Integrity is a, a complete package, a person who is now emotionally mature. All right, can we write number, number two? A wife is a person, a wife is physically and emotionally mature. I have removed the spiritually. Why? Because some might not be spiritually mature, but uh, to daughters of Jerusalem, you write physically, emotionally, and spiritually mature. They must be maturity in those stages. Physically, you must be strong. You must be mature physically. Hallelujah. We see that by your ability to do work at home. Are you strong enough to sweep the house, to wash clothes, or there is someone washing your clothes? Hello? Hello, girls. 
who ironed the clothes that you are wearing today? Is it your mother or someone? So you need to be physically mature. Can you do gardening at least? Even watering gardening, your garden at home. Can you do flowers? <laughs> Hallelujah. Because you must be physically mature. But some are still lazy. Girls are lazy. Wives are hardworking. Because uh, in girls, you know, there is a little bit of, of, uh, of carelessness and sometimes negligence in certain important issues. They don't take serious things serious. Like I was telling you, if you give a girl $1,000, you get 1,000 bananas. <laughs> because they are not yet even emotionally mature, even to handle $1,000. All right, even as you are working, some of you are employed, but do you know that some of you, you don't even have a bank account? And yet you want to be married. You don't even know how to manage money. What is it that you can show me that you have bought with your money, except uh, excluding bananas, something tangible <laughs> uh, from chips and pizzas? What is it that you can show me that, you know, this is something, Prophet, I have bought with my money? Because it's a sign you are ready to be a wife. A wife is a developer. They are not wasters. Wives are developers. They are not wasters. They develop. When you get... Because a man, when he's saying, I now want a wife, they are saying, I now want somebody who helps me to develop in life. Who, who can give me an idea that let's buy a stand, let's, let's build a house. Not someone, when I get money, what they think is, let's go to Honolulu <laughs> and enjoy our lives. When, do you know a girl, when you get a girl, a man who gets a girl is in trouble. Because a girl wants joy. They are not worried about, about assets. They are not worried about properties. Even if you give them 50,000 US dollars, they will plan a, a, a trip worth 50,000. <laughs> they will go to Scotland. Five days in Scotland. And they go ten days in Greece. And then they go to Hong Kong and enjoy internet. <laughs> that is very fast more than in Zimbabwe. And from there, maybe they go, maybe for, for 10 days or 20 days in America and come back without a cent. And she doesn't even care. Because that's the life of a girl. But a wife, when you give them 50,000, something will materialize. Buy a house or something. And now, now look at me. Am I saying it's bad to be a girl? It's important to enjoy being a girl. Because if you don't enjoy that life of being a girl, you'll be a girl when you are supposed to be a wife. So it's important to enjoy pizzas now. And pray for the work of God and enjoy your pizza even if you don't have a bank account, if you are using your, your, your money to buy shoes, a green one, yellow, orange, black, red, blue, all colors, it's okay. Because that time is very important of living a life of a girl. Don't skip it. Hallelujah. Tell the person next to you, don't skip that stage. <laughs>